This video describes a device that can capture the human figure through walls using RF signals. We place our device behind the wall and it can see the silhouette of a person who walks in an adjacent room. The device works correctly even if the room is completely closed. For example, if a person stands behind the wall, the device's output looks like this. In particular, the output on the right shows the background in navy blue and the various human body parts in red, orange, and yellow. Here, we can see the person's head, chest, arms, and feet. How does this work? The device operates by transmitting wireless signals that traverse the wall, reflect off the human body, and come back. At every point in time, only a subset of human body parts reflect the signal back to the device. Here, we show the output of the device as the person walks. At different points in time, different parts of the human body reflect the signal, and the device captures multiple snapshots at various points in time. It then combines these snapshots through a reconstruction algorithm that allows the device to recover the human silhouette through the wall. Here, we can see the person's head, chest, arms, and feet. The device can distinguish between different people behind the wall. So for example, over here, we ask two different people to stand behind the wall, and this is the output of our device. By training on different subjects, we can use a classifier to distinguish between them. The device can also distinguish between certain human postures. If the person stands straight, the output looks like this. While when someone stands in other postures, the device's output reflects his postures. The device can also track human limbs from behind the wall. Here, we show a scenario where a person draws a shape in the air and we show the output of our device to the right. The device can trace the person's hand with high accuracy. We compare the device's output to that of a Kinect placed directly in front of the person and show the Kinect's output in red. In comparison to Kinect, our median error is around 2 cm. For more information on how the device works, check out our project webpage.